So we've had somebody call us out, and they've said that it doesn't say waived, it says warned. Well, first off, the fact that there's even a controversy on that should tell you that there's something wrong with this case, because why are we uh, having to look at a document where something has been altered on a federal form? So Assistant U.S. Attorney... Uh, Andrew Brown I don't know you but I think you've been careless you have horrible handwriting obviously and you know this it's a this is a federal document in a criminal probe about drugs okay and these are people who have terrorized Compton they've terrorized thousands and thousands of people who breathe easier because these guys are behind bars and now they're out and these people that have been terrorized are are feeling a little bit nervous about the fact that these guys are out. So it needs to be done right. Is it warned? Is it waived? Let's look at this. We don't need to look any further than analyze the handwriting to see that it's waived. If you look at the eye, and we'll highlight that here, and then you look at the eye in forfeiture in the word underneath, you can see that this is an I based on his handwriting. If you look a little further in forfeiture, you see an R. Does this look like an R or does this look like an I? This looks like an I. This is waived. And the way it works in contract law is if I'm giving up something, then I'm the one that needs to initial that I'm giving up something. So assistant U.S. attorney uh, Andrew Brown has given up something here on behalf of the government, so he initials. If this is an acknowledgement that they've been warned are going to forfeit if they violate a condition of, of probation, they would be the ones that would need to initial this instead of U.S. Attorney or Assistant U.S. Attorney Andrew Brown. And if you look at the AB, you can see that he is the one that initialed this. That should put to rest this controversy. And the fact that there is even controversy. This is a federal document. This should be typewritten if there's some kind of provision. And why are they getting any kind of special provision? Why do the forms not work in this case? That's a big question. And it should outrage all of you. All of you should get involved and let them know we are watching. We are all watching this case. There are thousands and thousands of people watching this case, and we are going to scrutinize every document, and every document is going to be widely circulated. So don't fuck it up, okay? Don't fuck it up. Throw the book at these guys. These are dirty cops. It goes back. I'm going to include a few Reggie Wright quotes, and any of you out there that have Reggie Wright quotes, Please send them to me. Please make sure that you know what the source is, because unless we can verify it, we're not going to put it out. Thank you. Every day in the hood is the same thing. Young niggas in the streets trying to gang bang. Selling crack in the backs trying to maintain. Got a cousin and he used to 